Hello all, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to find the first maximum, second maximum and third maximum from n numbers using array. So first of all, I need the three variables and that is integer first maximum is equal to zero, second maximum is equal to zero, third maximum is equal to zero. Now I want to ask to the user that how many numbers you want. So I am declaring one variable that is integer n. Now I am writing that printf enter how many numbers you want. Now here you can use the scanf percentage d to get the numbers. So here you can write scanf percentage d ampersand n. Now here you can declare the array. For example, I am declaring the array that is integer arr of n. So what happened if user enter that the I want the 10 numbers then this array will be created for the 10 numbers and if user want the 100 numbers then this array will be created for the 100 numbers. Now I want to get each and every numbers. So now I want to write the loop. So now I am declaring one more variable that is i is equal to 0. So now here you can just write for i is equal to 0 i less than n i plus plus. Now here you can write the printf to get each and every number. So I'm writing here printf enter number. Now I want that enter number one, number two, number three like that. So I'm writing here percentage d and here you can concatenate i plus one. So what happened? It will just get the number that is a number percentage d. The value will be zero. So here it will concatenate i plus one, zero plus one. So it will print the value that is enter number one then later on number two, number three and so on. Now here you can just write scanf percentage d and I want to store this in the array. So I'm writing here m percent arr of i. Now I want to check for the condition. I want to find it out that the number is greater than the first max or not. So if user has entered the number, that number will be available in the arr of i. So if number is available in arr of i, that is greater than the first maximum, then I want to set that value into the first maximum. But before that, I need to just shift that the third max is equal to second max. So what happened? Your second maximum value will be stored into third maximum and you can set the second maximum is equal to first maximum. So what happened? Your first max will be set into second max and then you can write first maximum is equal to ARR of I. Now might be a chance the number is not greater than the first maximum but it is greater than the second maximum. So here you can write the else if. If number is greater than the second maximum. If number is greater than the second maximum then definitely I need to set that number in the second maximum. But before that I need to shift the value. So I will just write here third max is equal to second max. And here you can write second max is equal to ARR of I. Now might be a chance number is not greater than the first maximum. Number is not greater than the even second maximum. But might be a chance number is greater than the third maximum. So here we can write the condition if ARR of I is greater than the third maximum. Then third maximum is equal to ARR of I. Now what happens see each and every number will be asked from the user if that number is greater than the first maximum then definitely we will set into the first maximum but before that I'm just assigning the second max into third max. So I'm just shifting the value of the second into third first into second and that value I will set into the first maximum. So at the end of this loop all the number will be get from the user and this code will identify the first maximum, second maximum and third maximum. Let me print the number. So I'm just printing here printf slash l first maximum is equal to percentage d and here you can print the first max. Here you can just copy this and you can paste. This is my second maximum. So let me write here this is second maximum is equal to percentage d second max and let me paste and this is my third maximum so let me write here that the third maximum is equal to 
and this is Tmax. Now you can build and run this particular code and it will ask you for the enter how many numbers you want. So I'm just writing that I want the eight numbers. So it will ask the eight numbers from the user. I'm entering the number for example 87, 67, 98, 102, 64, 76, 80, 62. And see here I'm getting the result and the result is first maximum is 102, second maximum is 98 and the third maximum that is 87. So this is the way you can find the first maximum, second maximum and third maximum from n numbers given by the user using array in C language. So that's it from my side. If you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.